boom pals out we just got this brand new ice coffee um, cold press coffee maker pot from Amazon it was on sale for only like $13.99 and I'm going to wash it first and then I'm going to instruct you oh it's upside down <laughs> instruct you how to uh, make the co the cold press coffee probably read uh, the okay so I've washed everything off it's going to require 16 tablespoons of coffee in this thing right here. And it's gonna get you I'm, high. <laughs> it's gonna get you energized. Yeah. And two cups of a water. Heart attack. <laughs> Let's hope not. Don't do that if you have high blood pressure. <laughs> this was a gift. I usually don't get the fancy um, coffee from Starbucks. Maxwell House. Can you use, you know, this you can is, use Maxwell House? You can use Maxwell House. You can use Folgers, whatever's on sale. What's the grater for? <laughs> That's when we were digging for the teaspoon in the door. Oh, okay. <laughs> so what you do first is... Tablespoon. You put this uh, grate thing right here towards the um, spout. So you can pour it. Yep, so it's easy pour. And then you're going to put the this till it snaps down in there. And I'm gonna use the, the coffee out. I kinda wanna use this because I've had it for a little bit. This smells really good. Oh, this is uh, where the teaspoon, oh, teaspoon thing. Yeah, okay, so this is the tablespoon. So it says 16. 16 oh, tablespoons. That's okay. You better not make them One, heaping. Or level them off. Two, Hold, Three. please. Three hours later. Fifteen. Sixteen. All right, sixteen. Okay, so now I need to get two cups of water. I think I'm gonna get a bottle of water, which is what? Two cups. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this is a 16.9 ounce uh, bottle of water. And you have to pour it slowly over the coffee. So this this should be enough for two days, but um, make sure you plan ahead. Enough caffeine for two days. <laughs> you gotta make sure you plan ahead for this. So. I can, you can and make already... sure you're not gonna go to sleep anytime soon. <laughs> well, you do this in the, you drink it in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Well, if it takes 24 hours, it'll be ready tomorrow night. Well, I'm not going to... You know what? It must keep. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you can have it. Better, it yeah. better keep. I bet you can probably have it for like uh, <clears throat> a couple days or so. It doesn't like it's feeling up. Feeling up? <laughs> <laughs> I hope it's my not accent. feeling up anything. <laughs> oh my God, it's feeling it up. <laughs> it's not... Filling up. Well, maybe it just has to go through this stage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I think you're going to need more water. No. It's got to go through this. Hold on. Let yeah, me read. It's about going through it. It says two cups. Let we'll be read. back Let in a minute. Okay. So basically, you fill it up slowly until it gets to the top. Mm-hmm. And then you stir up the grounds so two, inside. Two cups or one bottle. And then then you fill up the, they call it a carafe. Carafe, yeah, like a giraffe. Okay. Carafe. <laughs> it's a carafe. Carafe Okay, giraffe. so now I can pour this in. Sure. I just filled this up with filtered water from the refrigerator. I didn't get another Can't bottle. And waste another bottle of water on your $1,000 coffee. <laughs> no, this is cheap. It's gonna be. It's gonna save you money. Really, honey? Yes. Yeah, because you like you have like an ounce of it, and it's like worth a full it's cup going, of it's coffee. It's going slow now. See how slow it's going? But if you get the, because uh, you have to stir the giraffe up. What do you call this? Uh, Costco deal Ounce or the anything that's on sale at Winn Dixie or Publix? You get the, you get Higgly, the bargain wiggly. box. Piggly, piggly wiggly. <laughs> Wherever. Here, let's stir. Oh no, I gotta wait till it's full. So, 48 ounces is what is um, included in the stock brew coffee. 
and I just decided to stir it up a little bit. And uh, it's not all the way full, so maybe I shouldn't stir it yet. <laughs> oh no! I'm gonna pour the rest of my second. So we'll find out tomorrow night. Well, no, I think we're gonna have to. Let we're this... drinking this stuff and staying awake. We... I think we need to let it go down more. I'm gonna wait on it. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> So this is two bottles. I'm gonna watch it. Another bottle, huh? Okay. Yeah, two water bottles. All right. We filled up another bottle and it's like up to the top of the thing almost. So I'm just, I'm gonna try to get it at least. I don't I'm trying to fill it up to here. <laughs> right here is where the glass ends. I know it's starting to bubble. Maybe we shouldn't it's have stirred it yet. Bubbling. We can. I mean, we've been going Looks pretty like fast with this. I mean, you could probably go even slower. You know, like walk away and watch a vacuum the living room. Yeah, and watch a movie or something, and come back. I mean, yeah, I mean, it takes twenty four hours. Yeah, <laughs> you know, plenty of time. So. Okay, so that's as that's as far as it's gonna go. It's to the lip here, and it's to the lip here. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want it to go over. It looks like there's a little bit right here. I think I don't accident. splash it. So, you don't, and you don't want to go in past the, well. <laughs> Ow! Stop. <laughs> Something about the lips. The here, lip, the here, lip. And then you put the, oh, there's a hair. <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs> We gotta cut. Here, here, snap. All right, then you put it in your refrigerator. All right. Here we go into the refrigerator. Next to the mustard <laughs> milk. Okay, so we purchased some Dunkin' iced coffee today that we can compare. This was five dollars and some change. I'm gonna go ahead and it's been twenty-four hours. I'm gonna take this out. And it says on the um, instructions that the make sure you put the little holes going toward the spout that the coffee will stay good in the refrigerator for what did it say 14 days? Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's watch it pour. I'm gonna put the our homemade cold brew in the blue bottom cup. Let's see what it looks like with the light behind it. It's kind of milky, I think. All right, so hold please. I'm gonna open this. All right, so here we go. Here's the Duncan. It looks clear. It looks like a clear brown. It's almost amber. It's real pretty compared to ours. So we'll mm. do, we're gonna do a taste test. Somebody sick of me. <laughs> okay, Duncan's. Ours. Ours. The birds interrupting. It's about the same amount there. Would you like some coffee to go with so your coffee made do creamer? A taste test. Let me stir it up a little bit. You got a fork. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Stirring fork. And the color looks a little lighter. This one looks more. But let's do a taste test. All right. First, I'm going to taste ours. Tastes really good. This is stronger, but it says in the, in the directions that while it's brewing in the refrigerator that you could open it up during the daytime, I guess, and stir the grounds around and it makes it stronger. So we could try that next time. Or you can put that back in there, Letty. So yeah, you probably could do that too. I think that's what I'll do. But overall, I mean, it tastes really like 
I would say save money and try to perfect the way the amount of time that you leave the coffee in there and maybe stir and everything to get it a little stronger if you want it stronger or maybe you don't like it strong <clears throat> so boom past that I gave it a thumbs up Real quick I just want to add um, for cleaning it has a little screw off bottom here to make it easier to um, get the old grounds out all right like subscribe <laughs> <laughs> like subscribe comment and share, share.